hey lovelies welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be making this delicious roast potato yes guys easy roast potato so let's get right into the video So to make our roast potato guys, I'm going to be using two pounds of potato. Yes guys, and I already washed these potatoes. So all I'm doing now is chopping them. You can chop the potatoes to the size that you would like. I preferred mine in this size. You can even cut them in wedges. So all you have to do, wash your potatoes properly and then chop them. And we're going to cook these potatoes for at least 10 minutes guys. So here I have my pot with some boiling water and I had some salt. This is about three cups of water and I also add some salt. And then we're just going to go ahead and add the potatoes. I'm going to cook my potatoes for 10 minutes, guys. So after the 10 minutes, I'm going to come back and show you guys how I prepare to make this roast potato. so while the potato is cooking guys we're gonna make some butter sauce to add to the potatoes i have a quarter cup of melted butter and i add some parsley flakes if you have parsley you can just chop it and add it then i'm going to add a little bit of garlic powder and some paprika guys then we're going to add some thyme some thyme leaf i like to add thyme leaf fresh thyme leaf if you had thyme leaf at home you can just add the thyme leaf but i'm adding some fresh thyme leaf the more thyme it's better i really like thyme so i use a lot of thyme guys so we're gonna add this and then we're gonna come in with some more thyme leaf and then i'm going to just add a small amount of black pepper and then we're gonna combine this sauce together allow the potato to cook for 10 minutes and then we're going to add this butter sauce to our potato so it's 10 minutes guys and my potatoes are now cooked but i think maybe because these are baby potatoes i cook them for too long i should have cooked these potatoes for like seven to eight minutes or maybe six to seven minutes because they're a bit too soft but i'm still gonna use it because it looks like it can use because it's not mashing out so we're gonna remove the potatoes from the pot and we're gonna set it in a bowl and then we're gonna run some cool water on it and then we're going to come back add this sauce to it and then we're going to put it in the oven let it roast so after running our potatoes in cool water we're gonna add some of the sauce we're gonna leave some of the sauce to coat the potatoes after it's finished roasting so we're gonna add the sauce and we're just gonna combine the potatoes with the sauce you just want to mix it my potatoes are a bit soft so I am trying my best to take my time but I'm combining it together and then we're gonna put it in the oven to bake guys we're gonna roast them not bake but roast because we're not gonna cover it we're just gonna add it to our baking tray look at it so this is how it looks so here i have a baking tray with some file paper and i sprayed it with some non-stick spray and then we're just gonna go ahead and add the potatoes to our baking tray we're gonna spread them out so they can sit on the tray properly so when we bake it it does not stick so this is how it's looking and we're gonna Stick it in the oven and we're gonna bake, we're gonna roast it. We're gonna roast our potato. I keep saying baking, but we're gonna roast our potatoes. We're not gonna cover it. We're just gonna stick it in there and allow it to roast. And it's gonna be so crispy, crunchy, and so delicious. So now we're going to roast our potatoes, guys. The oven is already preheated to 200 degrees, and we're gonna roast these potatoes for 40 to 45 minutes. So after 45 minutes, 
this is what my potatoes are looking like guys it is smelling so good and we're gonna add some of that butter sauce that we had to garnish these potatoes and it's looking so good and we had these potatoes with some of the brown stew sliced fish that i made in my previous video so please go and check that out and this is my roast potato so don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video